Bonjour! My name is Bonation, welcome back to the SRL, this is week 8. I'm playing this after week 9. This match does not matter, it does not matter. It does not matter that it does not matter. Um, I'm just gonna do it. Jirachi's my lead. Interesting team that we both have. I'm pretty sure I have Stealth Rocks on you. Yes, I do. Let's do it. <coughs> He probably predicts my Jirachi lead. Uh, Cloyster. This is probably Scarf. If it's not, I don't know what the hell he's doing. I'm still not playing any games though, this is Thunderbolt. Right? He's probably Scarf. No games on the Cloyster though. No chance. Nailing it, nailing something with a Thunderbolt's fine, I think. Azumarill, Roserade wouldn't come in though. Actually, this is pretty good. Jirachi's very good in this match. It should be faster in this thing. Unless he's Scarf. I'm faster in everything on his team, actually. He is Scarf. Nails me with this Hydro Pump. It doesn't do too much damage though, and I hit this thing with a Thunderbolt, it should just knock him out, and it does. Cloyster's out. Very good. Very good. Choice Scarf. He probably thought I was going to Stealth Rock. Which uh, was my plan, but I'm not playing games with a Cloyster. Especially when I know so uh, feeble on that side. Azelf? Okay. Now that's pretty scary. Azelf is a very scary Pokemon. Uh, but I'm just gonna hit it as hard as I can. Again, with Meteor Mash, I don't want to play games. I outspeed it, actually. We both missed our attacks. <laughs> I'm actually faster in this thing, which is very interesting, so that means he has bulk investment or something, right? Actually, what's your speed? 158? 157. Endgame's also faster than this thing. I'm just gonna do that again. I land the second one. Very bulky, I get an attack boost. And here comes the Fire Blast. Because he's so bulky... Oh wow, it kills me. Is that a critical hit? Nope. <laughs> Did not expect that at all. But that's fine. Uh, but because he's that slow, Entei should also be faster than this thing. So no stealth rocks for me. I fire off an eruption here. This is Specs eruption. Uh, since I'm faster than this thing, whatever comes in is seriously being nailed. Uh, Moltres is probably the culprit, or whatever. It's actually gonna be Azumarill that comes in here. This does, still doesn't want to take this, I don't think. <laughs> does a lot of damage. I don't see anything. He probably wants to Aqua Jet, is my guess. Right? Like he would want to Aqua Jet, obviously, I think. How fast are you? 14. I'm faster than this. Uh, Zoomerel for sure. I think he wants to Aqua Jet, so I'm gonna go Romore. There is the Aqua Jet. No damage to me, really. Do I? Is that enough? I don't think so. Not enough to get back. Multi scale. Thunder Punch, however is a uh, gruesome hit, right? So I'm gonna Thunder Punch. Should be faster than this. Uh, Thunder Punch, I think, knocks this thing out at this point. If he switches, then I get multi-scale back. Unless I get burned from the Moltres coming in. So my thing. 
He doesn't want to risk this. He risks this. Okay, so the Moltres does come in. A Thunder Punch. Eh, not very good. Damage. We're both leftovers then? I'm not Dragon Dance though, am I? I get my multi scale back though. I'm not Dragon Dance. I'm Sap Sipper on Endgame, which is pretty cool. Go into. No, let's not go into. Captain. Captain Cook. What is his uh, answer to Suicune? I don't know. Just yet, but. Uh, how much bulk do I have on you? Probably not much, huh? A lot of special defense, actually. Let's go into endgame here. <sighs> I hope he doesn't Will-O-Wisp. That would suck. Please don't. Please, no. Bruce? Okay. He's probably maybe fishing for that burn. Uh, it's not happening, though. Right now, I just want to rock slide. Whatever. Rock slide. He doesn't... He wants none of that. What does he want? Some of MVP is who? Lucario's his MVP? Maybe I missed a week of battles or something, but... Okay, he does eat that. Very easily. Just takes that. Romare's my switch in, though. Hmm. Hmm. If this thing gets low enough, Earthquake can finish it off. Endgame's pretty good in this match, actually. Once, yeah, actually, no, she's really good in this match. Once this Lucario is weakened enough, she's really good in this match. No way I'm letting this, uh, close combat, whatever. Alright, breaks a multi scale again, but it's fine. Defense goes down for you. And it's life orb. Okay, that's good, just so I can ship it down. I'm gonna Thunder Punch again. So he went back to the monster, so he could burn me. Right, but I could also paralyze him, so. There's the Thunder Punch again. I paralyze him. There it is. That's really good. Because of that paralysis, I could easily, I could stay in and try to just, you know, chunk this thing down. Let's Thunder Punch again. Because of that paralysis, let's just do it again, how about... <laughs> There's the roost. Okay, so that's fine though, because I'm pretty sure, because of the paralysis here, uh, something's gonna go wrong. Also, I'm there, Melt Scale's back. So I could switch now, actually. Because that multi scale is gone. What if I go back in endgame here? I don't want to do that, though. That's so not what I want to do. Neither is going into Entei. Suicune is too early, right? Let's go Suicune, actually. Multi scale is back again. I don't know what a Suicune answer is. And here's the second, another Roost. Really would wanna, he really wants that burn. I'm pretty sure he has it. He doesn't have pressure, so he does have Flame Body. So he's getting unlucky with that. But Calm Mind here. What is he gonna do? Does he, I don't think this thing gets Whirlwind. If it does, then good for him, but I don't think it does. It's probably Roserade, right? Nope. This is a Zoomerill. Okay. I should be faster than this if I scald it. It should do some decent damage, I think. My strategy from taking on a Suicune with my Azumarill was to have Facade, and then right, and then if I got burned, then Choice Bandit Facade also did a chunk of damage. So that's good damage. Not very effective. No burn. Here's a waterfall. Okay. So he predicted something else, I think. To happen something else. I'm not going anywhere though, I'm staying in to take that hit, whatever. 
Scald again. Oh, he's... Yeah. He misclicked Waterfall. That is unfortunate for him, yes. But I scalded it again, so... He doesn't have to worry about it. Pushing the wrong button, though, is unfortunate, but he doesn't have to worry about it, because I didn't call mine again or anything. This is probably Rose Raid. It is Rose Raid. Not very effective, no burn. He no doubt goes for the grass to move, so I can go into endgame here. And with plus one attack, she's going to be very devastating, so I'm going to go straight into endgame. Please go for the grass type move. Any grass type move. Please go for the grass type move. Don't toxic. Leech seed. Not gonna work. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so now with plus one attack, I can just body slam. I will just body slam. You. A lot of damage to this thing, he goes with spikes. Excellent work. Spikes still I don't care about that. Remora I can defog them. He's switching. Please don't go to Moltres and finally burn me. MVP, this is Lucario, this is fine. I'm faster in this thing. I know I am. No paralysis, I know I'm faster than this. I earthquake. Please tell me I'm faster than this and I didn't screw it up. I am totally faster than this. Lucario goes down. I'm faster than Azel. I'm faster than Moltres. This thing can awkward at me all at once. With plus one attack, I am very ready to... He didn't even go for the Aqua Jet. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> I'm really ready to kill everything on this team right now. Zoom World's out, Lucario's out. He's got three guys. Roserade, Moltres, and Azelf here. Here comes the Azelf. Let's see if you can take a Body Slam, Azelf. Plus one attack. He can take it, and here comes Psychic. Oh, I think that specs. That was a that was a that was a nasty hit. That hurt a lot. Obviously not enough to knock me out though. And here comes another body slam. And Azelf is down. Yes. <laughs> yes. That's already three knockouts for Endgame. Yes! Yes! Here comes Moltres. Para Flinch, though. He has to beat Para Flinch right now. I could miss. Please don't, Endgame. Please don't. I land the rock slide. Yes! <sighs> Not enough to kill this thing, though. Oh, Para Flinch! No Para Flinch. He roosts, though. Worm, why would he roost? I don't know why he roosted there. Because he has to beat, he has to not flinch, and he has to not be paralyzed. His only chance is if I miss, and then he breaks through paralysis. That's his only chance. But it's not looking good for him right now. Rock slide again. I miss. Excellent work. Is that just a critical hit? Nope, this is enough to talk him out. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> and here comes Rose Raid. And here comes Body Slam, and that is. <laughs> Five. KOs for Endgame. Sap Sipper Sweet.
That's devastating. That is that is gruesome. Yes. Yes. Hey, listen. <laughs> listen, that was really that was good. Obviously the MVP here with leftovers of Jolly Nature and speed everything on his team, except for Azelf, but it ended up outspeeding Azelf because he was a bulky set, which is interesting. Sap Sipper. Sap Sipper was deadly. Um Yeah. Got the plus one attack, he crushed five of his guys. Hotter Slim Milk Drink Rock Slide Earthquake hits everything on his team. Um we got Suicune here, leftovers. Old nature, max attack, almost max defense, standard Suicune stuff, Scald, Sleep Talk, Calm Mind and Rest. Um, yeah. Jirachi here, with leftovers, naive nature, it was mine special defense, of course, I forgot about that. But I would speed everything on his team except for Azelf, but yes, Azelf. Meteor Mash, Zen Headbutt, Thunderbolt, Stealth Rock, I think he was max defense, max special attack or something. That's why he just was able to do that. No Stealth Rocks for me. But that's fine. They don't need them. Into here with choice specs. Did a lot of damage to that. Azumarill forced him to click Aqua Jet, but I wasn't wasn't taking any of that. But yeah, eruption, lava plume, Stone Edge, extreme speed, Stone Edge for Moltres, extreme speed for a like, belly drum, Azumarill, really bad, right? But a max, or uh, uh, no attack with timid. So yeah, Captain Cook supposed to be a male. By that, that was my bad. Cuss that berry, which means if it's almost dead, it gets priority. Quiet nature, which means minus speed, increase special attack. Put a little bit in special defense, decent amount in defense, decent amount in attack, good amount in special attack, and a good amount in HP. Lava plume, sunny day, earth power, and explosion. Either when I'm almost dead, I'm either when I'm almost dead, I either push explosion with a cuss that berry or sunny day for Entei. Right, so yeah, that's the idea there. And then Remore here. Impish nature spread all around, but like all around except for special attack with multi scale, obviously. Dragon Claw, Thunder Punch, Defog Roost, no Dragon Dance. Could have been pretty good, but no Dragon Dance. And yeah, that's the entire team. Obviously, endgame here with the beastly MVP uh, 5 knockouts. Very devastating. And that is week 8, and I've already played week 9, so yes, I am indeed going to the playoffs. I do not know who my opponent is in the first round of it, but that was fun. Good game to uh, Mr. Southside Braves. Oh, obviously he's the guy I play Pokemon Black and White with, by the way. If you haven't watched that, then maybe you should, because it's actually it's kind of funny. Uh, I think it's funny. Anyway, thanks for watching and listening to this. And yeah, playoffs. Bye. Smell you later.